Yellow Jacket continues to expand on their line of innovative refrigerant recovery equipment. This video demonstrates the unique features of the Yellow Jacket 68864 wireless refrigerant scale, the P51870 Titan digital manifold, and the 95760 Recover XLT refrigerant recovery machine while recovering refrigerant from a commercial rooftop unit. Make sure the power to the equipment has been switched off before starting any service. Remove the service panel and locate the system low side and high side service ports. Remove the service port caps and connect the manifold hoses to the corresponding service ports. Blue for low side, red for high side. Then connect the manifold charging hose to the suction port of the recovery machine and the tank hose to the discharge port. It's important to purge the air from the manifold and hoses before starting the recovery. With the tank valve closed, open the manifold valves. The wireless refrigerant scale has an integrated Bluetooth radio that broadcasts its readings to any smart device running the YJack View app. To get started, download and launch the YJack View app from a smart device. A list of available Bluetooth devices will appear. Power on the wireless refrigerant scale and tap the red banner to connect to the scale. Once connected, the weight reading, signal strength, and scale battery level will be displayed. To select the units of measure, tap on the three dot icon in the top right corner of the screen and select general settings. Here you can select the scale units to be pounds and ounces or kilograms. Click on the gear icon above the scale image. From this screen you can tear or zero the scale, turn off the scale, or recalibrate the scale if the factory calibration is compromised. With the recovery cylinder placed on the scale, we're ready to begin recovery of this system and tear the scale. To start a charge or recovery session, tap the three line icon in the top left corner of the screen and select charge recovery. The scale gross weight will display at the top of the screen in a numeric format. If a line graph display is preferred, simply tap on the numeric reading and select line graph instead. Below the gross weight is a weight change reading and a timer. Tap on either of them to set or reset them. To log the recovery data, tap on the three dot icon in the top right corner of the screen and select create data log. Select the logging rate, toggle on the charge recovery session type and tap save. Tap the record button to begin the data log. Now the tank valve can be open and the recovery machine can be powered on to start the recovery. In line graph mode, as the scale weight changes, the vertical axis of the graph will repopulate to show the full range of scale readings as the weight increases the refrigerant being recovered has transitioned from liquid to vapor. Turn the valve on the recovery machine to the vapor position. Once the system has reached the proper vacuum level, the Recover XLT will automatically power off. Turn the valve to the purge position to purge any refrigerant that is settled in the recovery machine condenser. This is a unique feature you won't find on other recovery machines. Once the proper vacuum level has been reached, the machine will again power off and recovery is complete. Close the tank valve. We now have an accurate measurement of the refrigerant recovered from this system. Tap the stop icon to end the data log. You can then save and email the data log for a future reference. We've successfully recovered the system using the Yellow Jacket 68864 wireless refrigerant scale, P51870 Titan digital manifold, and 95760 Recover XLT refrigerant recovery machine. For more details, 
Visit yellowjacket.com for product and customer support information.